like travel vlogs. So okay, lashes. I met Shadi a couple years. I'm like, I think she cute. When I'm at home trying to cool my head, only thing I see is you. Only thing I see is you. Thing hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. So I did not tell y'all that. Well, I guess I'm telling y'all now, obviously. So I am going to Paris the next week. So right now I'm just trying to like prep and find everything I need. Right now I'm headed to Ulta because I'm really trying to get that hourglass um, concealer. But I'm really, really nervous that I'm not gonna be able to take it on the plane because it's such a high, it's such so much liquid in it. I don't know, I'm trying to see if I'm able to like maybe put it in, ooh, see, I need to get a car, a car thing to be able to drive and talk. But I'm trying to see, am I able to like basically put it in like a, a, a travel container or something like that so that I can be able to have my makeup and stuff while I'm overseas or whatever. I was gonna ask one of the girls at Ulta. So apparently this Ulta that I'm about to go to, this was a new one and it's like the girls rave about it. Like they got people to do piercings in there they doing hair, they doing all types of stuff. So I'm really excited to see what they have in stock out there. I'm really hoping they got some good stuff. Um, My budget is honestly not to go over $60 respectfully because all I need is to get a concealer. I don't really need to go out my way to try and restock on my makeup because I already have makeup. I'm just trying to figure out how I'm gonna, well I am checking a bag so I really could just pack my makeup in my check bag of my day. Something in my spirit is telling me though that my check bag might get lost and this made my stomach sick. But my mom's with my flight is direct so my flight being direct maybe might be able to cut all that out but i'm still scared just in case but i will see y'all when i get to ulta i think i'm also going to tj maxx just because i'm really trying to find like a sweatery jacket or whatever to go over one of my outfits i might put my little white jacket on the call it a day but if not i'm still trying to find sandals to go over one of my outfits like walking sandals because you know paris would be walking a lot but it's also like I be wearing heels a lot of the time, but I'm like, I need to take my heels for the nighttime or daytime when I'm not doing stuff that requires me to walk. So with that being said, that's my hopes is to do that. So I'm driving it now. So I'll see y'all when I get to Ulta. I end up getting born this way. I'm trying to see what Juvia's Palace has. Um, Juvia's Place. I always thought Juvia's Palace. I'm trying to see what Juvia's Place has because I'll probably end up getting the Pink Lady blush and call it a day. I think I'm going to go ahead and get the Pink Lady. Because I just like that light pink. Mm. Okay, y'all, I'm back to the house after a whole lot that happened. So, like I was saying, I have to prep for Paris, so I'm just kind of getting like little last minute stuff. Pretty much all I have to do now is get my lashes done tomorrow. I'll take y'all with me. Get some little fake press on nails. I go to Rite Aid to get that, so that's nothing too crazy. And then, what's one more thing I had to do? Get my hair done. So I'm trying to get my hair done on Sunday or Saturday, depending on what day I really want to get my hair done, but that's the last thing I'm gonna do. And then, this will be a part of a vlog basically where I'm prepping and then I'm also um, trying on my outfits. So, Ulta, I got this Perfect Finish HD powder. So I actually have the pink one size and I'm thinking do like pink one size here, HD powder here, and maybe just to help set it all together, this on there. Um, I had to, had to get this Born This Way concealer because my Maybelline concealer is running out. This Born This Way, y'all, when she put it on my face, I forgot that I even had it on, honestly. I hate this so bad, but it is what it is. But this Born This Way concealer is so smooth and buttery. And then I also got some little small stuff. I got the e.l.f. blush, liquid blush, because I have the Juvia's Place blush, but the blush just be, the powder brush be separating too much and I'll be like a little bit confused. So I just did the liquid blush, make it easier. So it's like my pigment. I'll be able to put so much blush on to show with my um, powder brush. And then I just got the e.l.f. Dewy Coconut Spray pretty much, satin spray, because I needed a satin spray. Because the satin spray I had was from TJ Maxx when I was like a beginner in makeup and it's just not eating like I needed to anymore. And it'd be breaking my face out because there's aloe in it. So this is the Dewy one that I've heard good things about. So these are my little things I got from... Ulta. Okay. So these shoes been in my 
closet for a minute now but these are my little shoes i'm playing on packing i got these from target like last year but they was in my trunk for almost a couple months and i was like why where are my pink shoes at they was in my trunk the whole time don't be like me but i also have this hat i thought it would be super cute like you know paris babe see y'all look look at the baby he can smell streets that i got him from the store but look at the baby but yeah i got a hat then here go his treats i got him from salmon treats but I also got the bows. You know, bows are in right now. I thought it'd be cute. Who goes to Paris and don't wear a bow? Be for real. This is the skirt. Oh my God, I thought she gave me a hanger and she didn't. It's like a black midi. So I think I'm gonna put it on with kind of like a wrap and then wear it like that with the pink heels. Then I also got shapewear because when you be wearing certain clothes, you see your panty lines. And I just don't want to have that right now. So I got both of these so I can make sure that you can't see me panties. And then I got these really cute shoes that's gonna go with a lot of my outfits. I need walking shoes outside of heels. But they're really cute. You can dress them up. So that's what I can figure that. So next time I see y'all, probably you'll see me at my lash appointment and then we're getting our hair done. And then after that, we're gonna be trying on a lot of clothes. So see y'all then. Gym prep, cause I'm going out of town next week. You too. Okay, lashes. Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. So today is gonna be my pack with me vlog for Paris. I leave in approximate like what, two days? Today is Sunday, I leave on Tuesday. Technically late on Wednesday, but I gotta go to another city to get to Paris, so I can have direct flight. So I leave on Wednesday officially, but right now I'm just packing my clothes up so y'all can see what I'm packing. Let's get into the video. So my first thing I'm packing I need, I'm, I'm gonna check a bag. So when I check my bag, I'm gonna have my carry-on too. So hopefully this could be a good enough carry-on where I can put all my stuff in there and not have to worry about anything. Um, then I have this nice suitcase. I love her, I've had her for a while. And then I got these cute tags yesterday because I just thought this was really so cute. What is it really? It says, let the adventure begin and then see the world. And it's like really like postcards. Like that's so cute because I love traveling. So this is the suitcase I'm packing in. And then this also came with these little packages. Like this, it came with a five piece. So this one I'm packing with my shoes and stuff and I'm gonna break it up so it's not just all over the place in my suitcase. But these outfits have not been ironed yet. So I'm gonna try the outfit on and then I'm probably gonna iron it after the fact. So I'm just gonna put it to the side. And then iron, iron, iron those things that you just put to the side and then pack the bag like that. So let's go first outfit. Oh, what do I want to do? Okay. So first outfit, we literally have this dress. I think I got it from like TJ Maxx or something. This purse, Marc Jacobs, these sunglasses I got from like a local like store. These little cute pink earrings and then these like little jewelry so let's try that on so this is how i envision the outfit to be in my head right i envision dress and yes it needs to be ironed really bad i imagine this hat to kind of make it look very cute sporty and fun and cute because i have on these sneakers that make it really really casual oh ah! the way i have everything set on the floor is just not smart but i feel like this is really really cute like then I have this purse as an accessory. And then I have my like bracelets on. And then these glasses are to top it all off. Hold on. I'm sorry, I just feel like that eats like. Come on, I'm sorry. That eats. All right, I think the outfit was super cute. It's super cute, I just took off the hat, but I think this is super cute. This will be definitely a look on Paris streets. So I'm gonna go with the second outfit now. Here's the next outfit. I completely forgot to say, show up the outfit first. So I'm gonna make sure I do it for the next one. But this is the second outfit. I actually got this from TJ Maxx. It's so freaking cute. Got this to put my zipper. So. 
this is actually like a piece set so it's a top and bottom when i tell y'all the bottoms are so cute let me see if i can move the camera down i'm shooting off my phone just because my other like i was saying i'm shooting off my phone because my other camera literally was so freaking blurry or i could take myself hold on i'm just gonna go in the hallway so y'all can see me better but and then I have these shoes from TJ Maxx that I just got. So I totally still have like the black wire that holds them together on it. And then these glasses I thought were so cute. So I kept the really simple long earring glass, sunglasses, and then just a simple cute like little sporty watch. Um, so I think this looks super cute. Also, I forgot to say too. So I got these from our ladies that are wearing pants that like you don't want people to see your like panty line and stuff in. And I wear like a lot of linen and kind of like satin clothes and stuff. So I have these, I have a pair of black and tan. So it just basically helps not show that. So I think it looks really good. Oh, the purse. I'm forgetting everything. Forgetting the most important part. Don't do me, my purse has nothing in it right now. But this will be me walking the streets of Paris. Like, can you see me? All right, let me show up the next outfit so I don't make the same mistake. All right, friends, the next outfit, we're gonna go. It's so hard to try and show the jewelry too, but we're gonna do this top, this long skirt, necklace, earrings, and then I got a pair of sunglasses to go with it too. So, stay tuned. All right, peeps, this is the third fit. So it's kind of like this, I'll be on the Michael Jackson jacket, but it kind of gives that jacket. I got this purse with it. And then I have this black midi skirt. And then I have these really, really cute pumps. Can you even see them? I have these really cute pink pumps. And then these are the glasses and I have these earrings too. It's a statement earring, but. These are the sunglasses that go with the outfit. All right. For the next outfit, I have this dress. With these earrings and this glossos. I think this is gonna be one of my fave fits. But I'm I'm really planning on wearing this outfit with a bow. I just don't really feel like messing my hair up right now, but I'm planning on wearing this with a bow at some point. So one more time for the dress. I mean for the skirt. Pumps. All right, friends, this is the fourth outfit. Honestly, I don't keep up anymore, but so I got these glasses on. I kept the same necklace from the last outfit because I did think it looked so good still. I got these earrings, purse, and then this is just the long dress. The heels literally make it look so good. Let's see if I can show y'all. about having a hat on with it so like it really just takes this parisian fashion up a notch oh it's in the bag hold on there we go takes this parisian theme up a, a whole lot right so imagine me on the streets I just think it looks so good. All right. I'm so excited. 
next outfit's gonna be. Oh, this is so hard. Can I show out the jewelry? I'm not gonna show out the jewelry on this one just because it's so difficult. But pants and top. Top pants. Yep. This outfit. So I didn't say where I got the other dress from, but I got it from JJ Maxx. Um, so I have my Pandora bracelet. So I'm going kind of silver. I have these Fashion Nova earrings. I have my Michelle watch on. I got some links taken out of it, but I'm going to do it when I get back because I don't have enough time for that. I have these really, really super cute blue pants from TJ Maxx as well. I should really drop in a brand. The brand name is House of CB. It's so fire. I got that dress from there. That pantsuit I just had on, I had from there. Um, and then I got on the JLo with heels on. I had on a glass outfit. And then I got a Tory Burch purse on. So I think that this outfit is super cute. I didn't have any sunglasses packed for this outfit. I honestly had my glasses glasses packed. I was like, there should be at least one day in there I'm wearing like my glasses glasses. So this is what I had for the outfit. I think it looks super cute. My next outfit is, oh yeah, I have this jean jacket. Let me see what it looks like with it. I have this jean jacket just in case I was to get cold because they were saying May looks crazy over there. Like it keeps going back and forth. Kind of how it is over here, so. Oh, this is cute. So I have the jean jacket if it gets cold or anything. And then I could always like button the jean jacket up and make it into its own look. So I think this is super cute. So next outfit I have is this top. I'm gonna stay with my silver jewelry on. So this top, this skirt and see sunglasses okay here's the other outfit so i got this top from tj maxx i got the same silver silver jewelry on from earlier toy birch bag and i have this did i get this where did i get this from i got this from Nordstrom rack actually yeah and then i have my pink pumps again so trying to keep the same shoes in rotation so i'm not packing a bunch of stuff but and then i got these glasses i got off amazon kind of like a little fake celine dupe Ooh, ooh, oh oh Cute, right all right my last and final outfit is this cute little dress I thought it was gonna be such a cute dress out there gonna be I'm gonna team it up with some sneakers my pink New Balance sneakers to kind of you yeah, listen we're doing dresses and sneakers all summer that's just so cute and casual especially in Paris so this is the next dress outfit this is dress and these sneakers and this lily bag I don't know why I'm giving this dress probably like Eight years ago i do not know where it's from but it's super cute and i thought it was perfect for paris because like dresses and shoes are their thing so i thought it'd be super cute so this is pretty much all my stuff i lied bathing suit yeah okay this is the last official outfit outfit, but I have a bathing suit just in case we go like somewhere that may have a beach or a pool. And then I think I just have pajamas left. So bathing suit. I got this from a black owned business on us. On us is how you say it pretty much. Um, so yeah, it's very much money green, money long. So this is kind of like the end of my video because this is pretty much what I did. I did my I did my own hair. I ended up going to Dominican, so I did my own hair. All I gotta do now is get my press on nails. So the next time y'all see me is when I'm doing my travel vlog. So like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you on my next video.